I'm Jet. And I'm Star. And, and we're, we're the Wing Girls. Girls. And today we are going to teach you guys how to hug. Yes. And we thought it was like a basic human nature yeah, thing. Yeah, we thought that everyone was born <laughs> knowing how to do this. But not, you know, not necessarily yeah. true. We've had some really bad hugs in our lives. And a lot of you guys have been asking us about this. So yeah. let's clear some things up. Exactly. Okay? <laughs> and the truth is a hug tells a girl a lot about you. That is true. So you don't want to fuck it up. That's right. I mean, I remember with guys that I wasn't sure if they liked me or not. Mm -hmm. Like the hug is kind of the way to be like, does he want to bone me or does he not even care, you know? Like bone. See how she just switches <laughs> into sex? Like, God forbid someone want to get to know you. No. <laughs> the genitals out hug. This is a hug where your hips and your butt are way out of the center to avoid any touching of the genital area. Uh, if you have a boner, it's very useful. Or if you are not interested in this girl at all. Either one. The sideways hug. This hug is a good one for um, if you're getting to know a girl. It always feels good from a girl's perspective, but then you don't have to press against her boobs or genital private area. <laughs> but I think this one it could be like a friend hug, right? Like the sideways hug is like, you're not like totally into her, it's like, we're buddies. The back pat. All right, the back pat is when you're like going in for a normal hug and then you get a pat instead. It's like, you know, your teenage brother does it to his grandma when they hug. <laughs> your arms on top. This is good because it's a real hug, but it's awkward because it should go the other way. So like you as the guy, you don't want to have your arms around her like she's like sweeping you away into the sunset. <laughs> And she's she's totally, totally carry you yeah. off. Yeah, <laughs> like she doesn't want to have her hands around your waist. Around your buttocks. Yeah, <laughs> no, like waist is awkward. Man. Your arms on bottom. This is the perfect hug because it makes girls feel really good and taken care of and you're like a teddy bear and they feel like any minute you could just pick her off the ground and carry her away to a sunset dinner on the beach. All right. Yeah. <laughs> that is a good one. The tight squeeze. We love a tight squeeze of a hug. It, it like shows us that you're good in bed and passionate and caring. Just make sure you don't squeeze her too hard. <laughs> yeah, don't squeeze the life out of her. The I have no soul cold light hug. <laughs> this is the worst hug of all because it makes you think that you'll be this way in bed and it's like hugging a board of wood. <laughs> totally. <laughs> Ugh, I hate when people give like a wimpy hug. Yeah, it's like hugging like a zombie. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay guys, so that's how you hug. Wow, I'm so glad we went over that. Yeah. I feel a lot better. I feel like you feel a lot better. <laughs> I feel like, I do feel like I feel a lot better. So comment below and tell us what kind of hugger you are. Yeah. You know what I mean. You mother huggers. <laughs> <laughs>